written by Taylor DeLeo. They most recently competed at the Summer Series here at Chattahoochee Hills in July. They were winner, winners at Rocking Horse early this year at the novice level and have traversed through both training and this is now their second competition at preliminary. Taylor and Rebels Legacy over the Savannah table at nine as Hannah and Vital 8 make their way over. Hannah and Vital 8 finishing on a high note as they cross the finish line. They were provisionally clear here today at, I believe, I said their third competition together, so well done. In the festival field, clear through the first four fences, Kimberly and Accolade. They were most recently third at preliminary level here at Chattahoochee Hills in August. They were winners at Paradise Farm this May at the preliminary level. And completed the intermediate at the fork in April. They are clear now through the kidney corner. Courtney Kidney Coops at six and making their way now to the table at seven. The double roll, that's a very big bench-like fence just before the second road. Kimberly and Accolade well through the sunken road at eight and over the kennels at 15 is Taylor and Rebels Legacy. Been making quick work of this course, very efficient turn. Let's see what Taylor and Rebels Legacy do at the mounds at 16. A bit of an awkward jump over the first element, and they kind of half on, half on the mound, as many have done so far. And very tidy out over the B element. They're just two from home. Kimberly and Accolade and Michael and Songline, the only two on course now. These are the last two preliminary competitors. We're expecting to cross the finish line with good rounds under their belt. Accolade making his way now to the water. Kim and Accolade not very quickly through the water, but very steady and they were clear. That is an opportunity to make efficient turns and save some time, or just take your time and get good jumps out of it. They are clear over the cream brush oxer at 14 as well, making a right-handed turn now to the kennels. Michael and Songline at the Sharks teeth at 10, and they're clear. According to their record, this is their first competition together. Michael Pollard and Songline, they don't have anything on their record at this time. This is a nine-year-old Pecanor Stallion. Kimberly Keaton and Accolade, they're just one from home now. They've had a very nice round so far. Steady and consistent. They are over the last fence. Well done. They crossed the finish line. They're provisionally clear. 